Welcome back, everyone. Gremlin Archer here. Time for some more Project Zomboid. So I, I did a bunch of tailoring and unfortunately only got to like halfway, a little bit more than halfway through the, the next level. Tailoring is a very slow thing to level, so kind of annoying. But that's beside the point. Let's see about starting a fire. Like I said, I'm pretty sure. I know I've said this for multiple. Also, the timer's not right because I'm recording this immediately following the last episode. Um, I'm pretty sure we've got helicopter incoming today. Seems like it's been way too long for it to not show up. But I don't know, and I don't really want to wait around for it, so we're just going to leave. If it shows up while we're doing our fire, then just more fire, right? Seems reasonable. Close the door. Let's take we'll take this guy. Some of our plants are starting to seed out. It's good. Or sap sapling out? Sprout out? I don't know. Whatever word you would use there. <laughs> Let's leave the car. Let's leave the car over here. We're not too close if we need to run away. Oh, hello, zombie. Looks like she fell. She fell out the window. Okay, so we are good to start this, or as good as I think we can get it. We'll see. Let's, uh, like, I need my sheet, bro, my dirty rags to help start these things. I guess we can take the twigs too. Alright, so let's get started here. Light fire. Twigs. Dirty rags. I really hope the siren's not busted on this thing. That would be kind of hilarious if we do all this and then the siren doesn't start. Alright. Let's go. So now we walk through the middle. Hop in here. Nope. I don't know what I just did. No. Items on the seat. Here? Items on the seat. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Um, siren. Oh, hello. How did you get upstairs? So why did the sound seem to stop? Oh, it's still going. You just can't really hear it through the window. Wish I could see it better from here. It is working, though. <laughs> they're they're a coming just kind of slowly this is good good sound soundproofing on this uh building I'm probably too far away to get any skill ups from this right They are getting pulled in. If 
fire is spreading. A little bit at a time. You can only assume there's more going on around the edge on the other side. But obviously we can't see that. Everybody, just get right up all up in there. So the siren isn't as enticing as me. <laughs> so they're not, they don't seem to be pulling in as tight as they were when I was in the car. Oh, it's happening. Not much coming from that a that angle because, you know, we killed everything over there for the most part. But a little bit. It's just me crunching. Yeah. I just wanna, I wanna peek. I wanna peek. See, it's working. Might not be as f as flashy as it was when I was, when I was in the car with it, but it is working. Close enough to be getting skill ups now. So you have to get, and I'd rather not push it. But they're coming. Fire, like I said, the fire before is it's not as impressive as it was when I was in the car with it, but it is working. Hey, I leveled something up. Axes? So, no, that wasn't axes. Sneaking? Oh, hang on. What is leveling up? Things are leveling up. Oh, Lightfooted leveled up. <laughs> Just gonna stand here and keep getting skill, uh, skill things. So you get you get um, skill points for being close to zombies when they don't like don't know you're there. Come on, there's another one in there. I can see you. There you go. So I'm trying to get close enough to trigger the skill points. I have to move? Oh, I have to move. Okay, so every time, it's when I move around. It's not when I'm standing still. I think we just alerted a couple more zombies inside. Yeah, look at that. Look at that, look at that skill ups going. Ooh, is there another bride in there? <laughs> this is also one of the reasons I wanted to be outside the car. Just to work on our skill. Skill points. Let me fall back a little bit here. We're gonna just take a real, real quick, uh, quick break from that. You guys, somebody busted down the wall, the door back here. Oh.
I caught in there, huh? Excuse me. Zombies are getting caught in the building as they try and pass by. What does it look like in here? A little busier in there than I would like. Can't close that door. I don't know if they're coming for me or not. Or if they're just making noise. This guy's coming for me. Alright, maybe we go back upstairs for a bit. Yeah, let's go back upstairs for a bit. I'll fight them if they make it upstairs. <laughs> I should have brought some food. <laughs> oh, there goes a the door somewhere. Okay, that's getting a little uh, more exciting than I would like. They don't do well with stairs. <laughs> so let's peek out the window and see what we can see. Oh, still, still cooking. Still, still, still zombie. Zombie burn time. They have pulled down my sheet rope, so it's a good thing I got the second one. Should have known that was going to happen. It's not that many zombies coming from that direction, but enough to be annoying. Ooh. Still down there. Doing their thing. A lot of well dressed zombies coming down. <laughs> I assume they're getting like re um reclothed while they're near the the church, because there's a lot of really nicely dressed zombies down there. Walk in little circles. This always feels a little, little cheap, but you know, you, you do what you can. There's another one of those, light footed. Yeah, there's light footed. <laughs> We literally could probably level this all the way up while we were here if we really wanted to. Ugh. 
don't want to be snuck up on from behind. It's the thing I'm really worried about at the moment. There's not like a clear path through the middle of this building. There she is. I was really concerned about that one. I thought that she might jump out at me in a weird way. So there's actually a lot more zombies in this area than I thought there were. I really thought that we wouldn't pull nearly as many as it seemed to be showing up. Hello. Come on, I know you're out there. Ooh. Okay, way more zombies back here than I thought. I probably should have brought a katana with me. Oh well. We'll go back to the fire in a second. After we deal with this. Problem handled. Won't say solved, because it's probably only a temporary handling, but it is a handle. I stepped out this way because I want to I wanna peek at the fire from a different angle. See me fire a zombie? Alright, I'm, uh, I'm gonna have to back up here. I've gotten a little too close. I don't want to build up oh, too late. I was about to say I don't want to burn the church down. Sorry, church. <laughs> I didn't, didn't mean to burn you down. That they specifically didn't want to burn you down. Fire along the backside, it seems to not be doing so great. Unless it's just a trick of the light. Yeah, not nearly as much burning on that side as I thought there would be. I expected this to be like most of it when we when I just thought we just couldn't see it. There, fire zombie. We could get up here. We'd be close enough that this would still be active, but I would be in significantly less risk. Let's go ahead and do that.
Any food in here? Peanuts. Just getting a little, little hungry, so I'd like to deal with that if I can. All right. So if we come out here. Close enough that this is still active. But they're where I'm not really in any risk. <clears throat> I can still see I can still see some fire burning inside the church. Alright. Let me hammer on this five three times speed here for a bit. should probably face this way in case something comes out of the door. <laughs> it's not as exciting as, as watching it from the inside the car, I gotta say. But that's okay. Oh, looks like we got pretty much everything over there. Let's see if we can get that light, get that turned off. I probably should have worked on getting the veil of the thing, the the one, the, the veil out of there before we did this too. All right, come here. All right, there's like a lot more of you. I think there was a lot more of you coming that didn't get properly, because of how far away I was, they didn't get properly activated. So let's go, let's go back through the fire here. Oh, I didn't even see that. Oof, I need to stay out of the, out of the, uh, Stay out of the ash. I can't see hardly anything in there. Hmm. There's a couple of zombies still on fire, but not a lot of them. Alright, let's come here. Come with me. Starting to get there. You guys burning. You're no good to me if you're not burning. I would really love to get in there and turn that off too, but I can't, unfortunately. How on fire is it inside? Pretty on fire, okay. I get through here if I try and cross oh, there's not really a way to get through there although if I go this way they'll probably try and come through straight through the middle of the building to get to me maybe that work <laughs> Oh, 
gonna walk through a tree. Come on. All right, did that work? Yeah, that sort of worked. All right, I'm gonna back off. We can always come back here tomorrow and check on it. If that car battery dies, it's fine. We'll find another one. But I think that is good for the moment. Apparently, I'm gonna have to kill you because we're getting very tired. I think what happened there is I got too far away from the um, the car that there was like a big range where it wasn't really pulling them towards the car anymore. So then the ones that were there burnt out without new ones showing up. I think that's what happened. Hard to tell exactly. But I think we're going to stop here for today. Thanks so much for joining me. I'll see you guys later.